The worst idea ever tonight takes us to the WNBA. Yes, women's basketball is underway at the professional level. Some great games in the docket. Frankly, I like the WNBA. I enjoy watching their games sometimes more than actually the NBA. They move the ball, hit the open woman, make shots, share. It's not all about dribbling. It's not all about individualism. But the worst idea ever tonight is not lowering the rims to nine feet. Now you're gonna go, Tim, how can you do that at the high school level? You're right, you can't. How can you do it at the college level? A little bit easier, right? Portable hoops, you're able to lower the rim a little bit. But at the professional level, it is an absolute must. When we watch the professional game from the men's side, what do we see? Explosive dunks. The game's more athletic. But for women, I actually think they struggle, especially running off down screens and trying to explode to get the ball to the 10 foot rim. I think lowering the rim not only will make the game more athletic and more fun, but it will make it easier to play, more fun to watch, more scoring. All the things that we ask for when we watch basketball, by lowering the rim, it will make the game, frankly, better. And don't take it from me, who had this suggestion, who told this to my own face, UConn head coach Gino Oriema. Seems like a pretty successful coach. Elena Deladon, the best player in WNBA. She wants to do this as well. So when I watch the games and I don't see the explosiveness, when I don't see the highlight jams or highlight dunks, it's disappointing. I think the WNBA is sitting on a giant. All they have to do, come down 12 inches. So the worst idea ever tonight is lower the rims, please.